Hello everyone, my name is Kevin and welcome to Spaced Out Gaming. Ugh. And welcome to episode 9 of the For Honor Let's Play. Uh, we are doing chapter 2.3 and as you can see I do have 3 out of 5 breakables. I was recording this before and my and the Ubisoft servers ended up crashing. Um, so I stopped, I had to stop the video. Um, I didn't save, save it either because it was kind of just useless to have. Um, so sorry about that. So you guys didn't miss, miss a bit. You guys missed me get the th first three breakables, which isn't much. I kept dying anyway, so I didn't get very far. Um, so this also goes up today, um, the day I'm recording this. So we're going to get into it. Uh, Stagandar, the last warborn Jarl, leads the assault to the... To clear the knights from the Viking shipyards, five observables, five breakables. It is chapter 2.3, wood, iron, and steel. Without further ado, let's hear the tale. The Vikings united. And so quickly. Now they turned their attention to us. I left some of my Blackstones in control of their shipyards at Valkenheim. Stigander, their new Jarl, set out to take them from us. Okay, uh, so yeah, this goes up the same day as episode 8, which is chapter 2.2. Cyrus, go lay down. Go lay down. There's a cutscene that you guys are going to miss because uh, you can't watch it because of the fucking stupid crash, so that's just fantastic. Uh, I'm going to be up at a checkpoint too, so I, I think. But yeah, I was uh, pretty far into the video, and then next thing I know, Ubisoft servers crash, and... Because I was uploading the payback predictions, and I was like, oh, great. So now I have to fucking spend even more time recording today. And I have to upload this. And then I'm going to eat. Alright. Oh, we maybe there's an initial cutscene. Sweet. And I had been out of action for long enough. See, last time it showed that cutscene before it showed my my character menu thing. Hardcore parkour. This is the same Viking I started with this this game with, by the way. Oh, when I started uh, online. Smells like cat shit in my house. It's fantastic. These black stones have done a poor job of fortifying our defenses. Uh, so yeah, we have a breakable here. I needed to get that gate open and fast. I'm not even kidding you guys, before I ended this, I got knocked into water before it ended, before it crashed. I knocked into water and then started this back up, was running this way, and then it crashed. So yeah, I was not very, very, I was not very happy. Uh, here's another breakable. Honestly, this is not the way I took the first time, but it was the way I took the th every time after that pretty much. Until the time when it crashed and I just kind of ran around like, fuck this, I'm done. Okay. I'm gonna run this way. Now you guys may just think I'm running away, which I'm not. I, I mean, I am, but I'm not. 
Um, there's a fire flask over here that I want to pick up because I can use it against these fuckers. Boom, timed it perfectly. I also killed myself one of the times using a fire flask. Um, I was almost dead at that guy with the giant saw blade. Uh, I barely killed him in time, and then as soon as I, and then right after I killed him, I, I, I accidentally walked through the fire and it killed me. Okay, little minions. Fuck off. You ain't gonna do shit to me. All right, this is also my first time going up this ladder. So, uh, yeah. Just as fucking soon as it blew up too. Holy shit, that timing. And by timing, I mean complete and total fucking luck. Oh, hello. Now, I'm not going to open the gate just yet. Um, I could. I'm not going to, but I could. Bitch. All right, so I'm not gonna open the gate yet, um, just because there's more things I want to do. So yeah. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Sweet. Right, let's go pick up this fire flask. Uh, one of the other breakables is down that way by where those at last assholes were at. By those guys. Um, to right over there. Right where my dot's at, kind of. Um, so we're going to go this way. Um, ooh. Hello. I missed the one dude I was actually aiming for. God damn it. Alright. Seeing as how he's not going to move his spot for some fucking reason. They never move. Like, they'll just sit there. So I can just easily do that. Oh, I can break those. Missed. Yay. No, I missed again. Fuck. God damn it. Oh, come on. Tell me no matter which way I aim that, I'm going to miss. I bet I can fucking not even hit him with this one, can I? Wait. Let's just get rid of all those break rules really quick. Don't need to waste my time. Sweet. I got him. Alright, so we're gonna go up this way and we're gonna go. And we're gonna break. We're gonna pick up that brick pool. Oh, I can't jump there? No! Fuck, okay. Um, I still haven't seen any of the observables. I don't know if it's just because I'm missing them. Like if they're just really like in a really weird spot or what, but I'm not seeing any of them. I bet I can't hit that guy, can I? I can't. Damn it! I wanted to kill him. No, I have to. Uh. Okay. To hit him, I have to go down here. I'm not gonna run this way. That was easy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm still not seeing any observables, so I'm guessing I'm not there yet. I'm guessing they're in a different part of this. So yeah, if I remember correctly, the other breakable is inside of here. Let me just go this way. Let me just jump down. Is it in here? Yeah, it's right here. This is the last of the breakables for you guys if you need to know. Um, so yeah. Now you guys know. See, I, I can find the breakables very easily. The observables, on the other hand, are a lot tougher for me for some reason. I think it's just because I don't look at the game too, like around the game too much. Oh, I have to hold it. I thought it was one of the ones you tap. Kill them all! 
I should get to the ballista. Save me some Blackstone helmets. I should get to that ballista. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Alright, let's do this. I almost pity those lights. Why did I, why did it take me off the blister? Did I get shot? I must have gotten shot. Thank God. Got that with five seconds to spare, you guys. Whew, I almost, I almost lost. One's gone. Two's gone. Julius, get your bitch ass back here. Bye bye. Ships washing up all summer long full of this chunk. <laughs> the Samurai! They're weak. We outnumber them ten to one. And they've had a good year! Ooh. <laughs> it was time yes. for the raid. <laughs> also, with the other video with uh, chapter 2.2, I accidentally called it Raiding the Raiders as well as the first chapter, which the first chapter actually is Raiding the Raiders. The second one was Biking Diplomacy. I don't know why it went up as Raiding the Raiders. I don't remember actually putting in the title. So, sorry about that, guys. Uh, it's changed now to Viking Diplomacy, though. Thank God. Hoping for quick spoils and perhaps the glory of victory, the Vikings turned their attention on their neighbors across the sea. The samurai lands were guarded by an ancient sea fort, one that the Vikings believed to be poorly defended. All right. Next week will be 2.4 and 2.5. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will see you next time. Stay golden. Peace.